Now that we have some idea what LaTeX is and what it can do for you, let's have a look at advantages and disadvantages. So you can make an educated choice whether or not you want to invest in it to learn the system or not. That said, obviously, the main disadvantage is that you will have to invest time in it to learn it. There is a certain learning curve. You can get started in half an hour or so, but in the beginning you will need some time to get used to it and get the basic things done. Afterwards that will come a lot easier and you can use the work that you did in the past to move forward faster. And after 10 years you will realize that you still can learn a lot. If you want a disorganized document, for whatever reason, well then LaTeX might not be the best choice. LaTeX is rather for structured, neatly organized documents. Also, LaTeX, well, it is something like a programming language. So it will take some time to learn, it might be difficult for you, and you will enjoy it if you like coding. If you don't like coding, you will probably not enjoy it. That said, I believe there are also plenty advantages for LaTeX. Well, the first advantage is probably that it really has a very professional look. The document looks automatically good. You don't have to invest any effort in making the document looking good. <clears throat> looking professional is the standard. You can focus on the content. LaTeX will take care of the layout. And whatever you produce is platform independent on whatever machine or in whatever form you want to present the results, it will work just fine. If you want to automate your workflow, integrate into a workflow that is highly automated, let's say pulling in data, producing visualizations and summarizing things, all that will work very smoothly. In its simplicity, LaTeX is very efficiently integrated in any workflow. If your document becomes very large, like you have a lot of movies and pictures in it, it takes a lot of space, a regular editor will get rather slow and will slow down because of the size of your document. Well, in LaTeX, those pictures, well, they will only be in the final document. They're not in the document that you're editing. The document that you are editing is just a text file, and that will continue fine. Also, if you change one of those images, you don't have to worry about copy-pasting it again in your document. LaTeX will pick it up automatically next time the document is filed. And throughout the company or throughout the organization where you are using LaTeX, you will find that there is a high degree of consistency because users are focusing on the content. Layout is defined once for all. It is also good to know that the skill that you will be learning is a skill that will last. You see, what you see is what you get text editors like Microsoft Words. Every five years they go to a major rework and you will have to retrain yourself and spend a lot of time in figuring out where the feature that you need is buried in the new menu structure. Well, here not. Whatever you have learned, whatever you have done, it will continue to work. It is also the de facto industry standard for scientific publishing. Basically means that whatever you have been trying, well, if you're stuck, you will find help on the internet and most probably the answer is already there. You won't even have to wait to find the answer. For me, one of the most important arguments to use LaTeX is it is really rewarding to work with. You will spend some time in it. But afterwards, when you have a similar problem, you will be able to reuse your hard work and the result will look impeccable. You are in control. You decide what happens. And you're not limited by whatever is available in the menus or the taskbar of your text editor. So to conclude, do you use LaTeX or not? Or when do you want to use it? Or 
let's start with thinking about when we should not use it. But when you're just keeping notes, like post-it notes, probably LaTeX is overkill. But anything from a one-page letter and upwards, LaTeX is absolutely the best choice. And LaTeX can accompany you all the way up to documents that are thousands and thousands of pages. If your document is intentionally unstructured, well, then you won't need LaTeX again. If you want to hide the lack of content after things that move and pop all over the screen, well, it is possible in LaTeX, but again, that is not what LaTeX is designed for. If you are the decider for corporate and you will have to consider if you want to use LaTeX or not, well, if you are intending to use it for people that have no scientific background, well, remind that it will come at a learning curve. And those people will probably not have met LaTeX before. If you work in an engineering department or in a mathematical model de modeling department, for sure people that work there, well, they have already encountered LaTeX in their past and they probably will love it because it suits very well their quantitative mind. Obviously, you will have to invest some time in it, and if people, as I said, are unable to learn it or just can't spend the one hour to learn it, well, then it won't be the choice. So, another argument I think against using LaTeX could be that you want that social contact or that buzz around new text editor, and every five years you want to train people. Also, if you prefer to pay for your software, well then, again, LaTeX is not the most natural choice because it is freely available. So, when would you want to use LaTeX? Obvious thing that comes to mind is when the document is structured. When the similar type of documents happen over and over again. When the document is really large, really complex, and when you want your users to focus on content and not on the form or how it looks like. When you want to integrate artifacts from many sources, like pictures, plots, data, tables, that are all generated by many different systems, the way to pull them together naturally is LaTeX. When you value consistency and professional looks of your documents, well, LaTeX will have that by default. And you can, yes, you can use all the layout that you want from the American army to private companies. We all use LaTeX and we all use our own professional look in LaTeX. When automation and integration is paramount, then definitely you have to go LaTeX. It will make your life so much easier. And obviously, Strong argument, as far as I'm concerned, is, well, you don't have to pay for it. LaTeX is free. So why would you pay for something that is really available? Right. Thank you very much. Have a lovely day.